Hi, this is Dr. Sherman Fung. Today I would like to share with you a snapshot of the development of global biotechnology outside Greater China, the dramatic development of molecular biology, which led to the creation of new scientific fields such as genomics, proteomics, and metabolomics, resulted in an explosion of biotechnological applications at the turn of the 21st century. Among the most prominent of these applications were the production of a large number of vaccines that prevent many infectious diseases and the development of more efficient, nutritious, and durable hybrids of plants and animals. It is also worth noting that various industrial products such as ethanol, organic acids, antibiotics, and biodegradable plastics have been developed as applications related to improved food preservation. There are genome editing technologies that are well established, research tools, with CRISPR-Cas9 being one of the most prominent examples. These technologies hold great promise as a basis for the future growth of gene-based biomedicine, as well as the use of biotechnology as the key enabling technology for the industrial production of pharmaceuticals and fine chemicals. The perspective of advancing biotechnology in society is one of the missions of professional organizations such as the European Biotechnology Thematic Network Association. As part of its role in promoting awareness of biotechnology, the association has published several reviews that address the growth of the biotechnology industry. Basically, it is possible to classify the biotech industry into sectors that include biopharma, industrial biotechnology, agricultural biotechnology, food biotechnology, environmental biotechnology, and bioinformatics. Here is a snapshot of biotechnology activities from major countries around the world. 1. In the U.S., when it comes to biotechnology, the United States is at the forefront. Since 2014, the U.S. government's investment and support in the biotechnology field have reached record levels. However, we can say that 97% of the mentioned bioindustrial income and 96% of employment is realized in the USA, Canada, and European countries. According to statistics, there are 318 companies in the USA annual turnover of 33 billion United States dollars based on large companies with official records. It has been reported that a budget of 20.5 billion United States dollar has been dedicated to road studies in the field of biotechnology in the USA and 7.6 billion United States dollars in Europe in previous years. Two, in the UK, UK has been making serious studies and investments in drug discovery with biotechnological approaches to genetic coding, DNA nucleotides, and the like. It is estimated that approximately 183,000 people are employed in the life sciences sector in England alone. Of this number, 23,000 are employed in the field of medical biotechnology and 3,000 in the field of industrial biotechnology. The business volume in medical and industrial biotechnology is calculated as £5.7 billion pounds for 2014.3. In Israel, Israel is a fast-growing country in biopharmaceutical and biotechnological industries. Israel pioneered bioincubators and has had unicorns such as Tevis Copaxone creating multi-billion dollar revenues. Furthermore, the academic setting has pioneered numerous startups with many these days in the high-tech of biotech including medical devices, pharmaceutical, digital health, utilizing AI, clouds, mobile, big data, Investments are in the billions and NASDAQ exhibits also billions in companies related to life sciences.4. In Germany, since 2013, Germany has been developing in the field of biotechnology based on international cooperation. In a study conducted with hepatocytes in 2015, they obtained liver cells in a laboratory environment. The most important company in Germany in biotechnology and genetics is Kigen.5. In Japan, since 2010, Devices have been produced to create neural networks from pluripotent stem cells in Japan, which has shown an increasing trend in biotechnology. They have developed promising treatments for the connections between neurons and various organs in patients with peripheral nervous system damage. Six. In Singapore, in 2015, a synthetic biology center was opened at the National University of Singapore, and 25 million United States dollars was spent on this center. The Singapore government allocated $13.2 billion for science between 2016 and 2020. Singapore advances in science and biotechnology every year. Well, that's what I am sharing with you today. Thank you for listening.
喜歡我嘅視頻，可以訂閱我嘅 YouTube 頻道啊，同埋 like 我嘅視頻啊，多謝大家。